And at a high level, what I learned is leadership is not linear. And that in and of itself is like a very big insight that most people don't get. And what I mean by that is if something's good for you, if it's good to be, let's say, confident or it's good to delegate, then wouldn't it be better to do more of the same because it's good? And it turns out that's hardly ever true. I'm not going to say it's never true. I'm sure somebody can invent something, but it's hardly ever true. It's almost always a balance that's required because you can become too confident. You become too overcom overconfident. You could delegate too much and not, not kind of be there as, as kind of a central player. And so the paradox is the reality of leadership. This is why it's not so simple to do this. You need to have, it's a, now I'm talking about almost a Zen quality here, right? To embrace paradox. And that's certainly what I, that's certainly what I found in all of those examples that you just shared.